Hey there, tech fans. Rick here again with another product review. And today, I have the brand new Link Plus USB-C Hub. Now, I spend a lot of my time on the road, whether I'm presenting to clients or I'm actually editing videos on my laptop, and I love how small and portable these new laptops have become. They're thin, they're lightweight, they're really easy to bring along, but the challenge with most modern laptops is to make them smaller, manufacturers had to reduce the number of ports that are available on them to get that thin size. And that's a challenge because even though I love using the laptop on the road, I want to connect up an external monitor to do video editing, or maybe I want to connect up a microphone and a web camera to do some type of streaming, and I can't do that on the laptop natively. For example, this one, which I take with me everywhere, has got a single USB-A connection on one side and two USB-C connections on the other side, and one of those is used for my charger. So I've effectively got one USB-C and one USB-A. So if I start trying to connect up a lot of peripherals, it makes it really difficult. I can't directly connect to a wired internet connection. I can't connect up an external monitor. So with a laptop like this, you need some type of external device that allows you to expand the port connectivity on the laptop externally. Now, I've reviewed a couple of hubs on the channel, and I have a bad habit when I'm presenting to clients a lot of times, I'll forget and leave my hubs behind. So I'm constantly checking for new hubs that are released and see if I can find one that's a little bit cooler than the one that I left behind at a client's site. And I found this brand new Link Plus USB-C hub. Now, I'm gonna do a quick unboxing. There's not a lot to show you. When you pop open the box, you get the hub, you get an instruction manual, and that's it. And I love that kind of packaging because it's recyclable material, so I can throw this right in the garbage and not have to worry about it. Not a lot of plastic, not a lot of foam, and I get what I need, the hub. Now, the hub itself uh, is really attractive for a couple of reasons. Number one, it's all aluminum, which means it's going to be incredibly durable. It's going to last a long time. When I throw it in my bag, I don't have to worry about a plastic hub that may crack or cause issues down the road. I like the fact that they don't have a long USB-C cable on it. Some of the hubs come with this gigantic USB-C cable, which doesn't make a lot of sense because what I'm plugging into the laptop, I would have normally plugged into the side. So having a short cable like this just makes it easy to put it on a desk and not have a lot of cables hanging around. So the hub itself has got a lot of connections externally. For starters, it's got an RJ45 connection on it if you need to connect to a wired network. Now, that's hands down the fastest connection you can get to your laptop. So when I'm home and I'm working here in the home office, I definitely want to connect up to my router. And this is a gigabit ethernet, which means it's the fastest connection I can get over an RJ45 cable. It also is speed sensing. So if you've got an older network that's 100 megabits or maybe 10 megabits, first of all, upgrade your network. But second, this will speed sense that and drop down to the correct speed for whatever router you're using. But I like the fact that I can connect an RG45 up. The other thing I like to do with a laptop is connect up a monitor, and this is a full-size HDMI port on the side, which will give me both 4K at 30 frames a second, It'll give you 2K, it'll give you 1080p and even lower resolutions, and it's speed sensing and it's resolution sensing. So it can actually tell what kind of monitor you're using, make the adjustments needed to give you the best possible picture on that monitor. So it's a lot of automatic things built into it. You'll also find a USB-C connection here, and you might be thinking, well, what do we need a USB-C connection for? Well, as I mentioned, this port right here is for charging my laptop. So if I have a charger plugged in there, I can certainly plug the hub into the other USB-C port. But this hub is smart enough that if I plug this into my charging port on the side, I can connect up an external PD charger to this port and, and conduct 100 watts of charging current into the laptop through that port. So it allows me to use that port for the hub but still charge through that port, which is pretty amazing. A lot of the hubs don't do that, or if they do that, they're limiting this port to maybe 30 watts or even 20 watts in some cases. So the fact that this can conduct 100 watts of energy into the laptop means I can charge it, I can power all my external devices from this, like these two USB-A connections on the side, all with that single power supply. It also includes two full-size USB-A connections, which are USB 3.0, which is the latest standard, which means you're gonna get lightning fast transfers to external disk drives or anything you're connecting up to that, maybe like a thumb drive, you'll get really fast data transfers across that. And the thing I really like about it most, quite honestly, is a lot of these hubs tend to be big and bulky and they tend to be long or they tend to be thick this way. This is small, it's smaller than a credit card, and it's got a really nice form factor to it where it's smooth, it's not gonna get caught anything in your bag, and it's just really easy to use. I also like the price. When I priced out this hub compared to others that are on the market, this tends to be less expensive than other hubs that don't have all the features this one has built in. So for me, this is my latest hub. I'm sure I'll leave it behind at a client site somewhere and have to upgrade down the road. But for right now, this solves all my problems. It allows me to connect an external monitor, connect up to a wired network, have two USB-A connections working at the same time. And on top of it, I can charge through it, which is pretty cool in itself. So that's pretty much all I had for today. 
If you're interested in this, I've got a link below where you can go check it out on Amazon. And I know there's a lot of different hubs out there that you can compare this to. Some have card readers in them. Others have more ports than this one does. But for me, I was looking for a hub that was small. I could bring it along with me that had all of the essential connections that I need when I'm on the road. And this one fits the bill. So that's pretty much all I had for today. Thanks an awful lot for watching. And until next time, <laughs> stay nerdy. Thank you.